so hello everyone uh, in this video i will show you like how you can change ip address every uh, in every three second and uh, uh, for becoming anonymous over the internet this is uh, very much necessary so we will be going to look so here uh, the tool is being loaded uh, loaded this tool name is gr33 n35 ip changer so if i uh, put the interval over here uh, like uh, let me uh, change the interval to three second and uh, how many times so just uh, make it infinite time of IP changes and now it's a uh, start and it's uh, started changing our IP addresses so if I if I just go to my browser and I go to the website uh, dnsleaktest.com so uh, it's showing like I am uh, I am from Netherlands but uh, you all know like I am from India so uh, right now my uh, uh, my current IP is being changed that it is showing off uh, some different location if I move back to the terminal uh, it is reloading some another IP uh, just uh, give it few seconds. It's uh, reloading and all the IPs it is providing me through the Tor services. So if I again uh, go back to the DNS lead and if I refresh this website, oh, it's uh, still showing this. If uh, you are not able to check this out, uh, you just need to uh, close your terminal and then again uh, close your browser and then again start a browser. Uh, go to the Firefox and again I will be going to the DNS lead test and uh, now uh, still it's showing loading uh, slow slowly uh, and now i will be changing it uh, in uh, one second so it uh, changed a little faster so let it load here. and once i come over here if i refresh now it's in austria so that's how it basically changing my ip address every single uh, three second uh, you can set this parameter to one second also that i will be showing you like even uh, we have some tools that uh, will help you to change your ip address in um, like around five to six times in just a single second so uh, I will be looking for that tools also but uh, uh, just uh, uh, they are li like a little more resource taking tools that's why I'm not discussing that out but yes uh, this tip like uh, today we are uh, discussing the tool which is uh, GN uh, GR33 so uh, let me uh, go to a stage so uh, this tool we, uh, we are using like you can directly clone it from its uh, mm -hmm. github and right now my traffic is also going through Tor proxy that's why it's taking time so I'm just uh, closing it so I can load all these uh, details uh, smoothly and I'm exiting from my terminal so this is the particle tool like uh, this is a python based tool which is basically designed to automate the IP address changing and uh, basically uh, typically used uh, for anonymity bypassing the geo restrictions like uh, some of the content that you can't uh, uh, able to check from the internet like uh, if the content is of a China based and you are sitting out in India or a USA you might be not be able to see that so for that purposes you need to change your IP address to any particular location so for that purposes uh, we used to uh, use this uh, particular IP uh, changer tool and uh, like uh, there are a lot of feature this tool provides like uh, it uh, automate the IP changing process you don't have to uh, do uh, manually uh, it will be uh, doing it uh, by whatever um, interval you have set it it will be changing your IP addresses according to that and after that uh, it supports multiple methods like it supports the VPN proxies uh, tor, bit, uh, tor based IP rotations after that it is also a script based execution like uh, it can be used to automate all the data so uh, this particular tool we are going to use so first I am opening my terminal and I will be deleting uh, my tool and then I will reinstall that so you can uh, install it after this uh, after attending this out so if I go to my terminal let me uh, delete that so for that I will be doing RF and RF to remove and then uh, GR 33N37 uh, on IP uh, changer so this is the tool name that I am removing and now uh, the tool is being removed if I do ls over my terminal you can't see uh, this particular tool anywhere so now uh, the tool is being deleted so now I will be going to the github page again to install that so first you have to come here uh, in code menu once you press over here you will be getting this uh, link so just copy this link from here and come to your terminal and type get get clone and paste the link like control plus uh, shift plus v to paste the link and once i press enter it will start cloning and now uh, the clone is being done so if i want to uh, basically uh, here i have used rm command rm and rm to remove that like uh, it has removed all the files and directories uh, of uh, 
uh, this IP changer and now it has been installed so if I press ls over here uh, once again let me check where it is so uh, here we can easily find this like in a previously uh, in uh, my file type it was deleted but uh, here uh, now uh, this one is uh, installed so I'm just copying it and I'm moving to its uh, directory so now I am in this directory once I press ls uh, here we are having some file like ipchanger.sh so let me clear once again and if I press ls I am having like um, uh, this particular file I need to run so for that I will be doing uh, once again sudo uh, dot slash um, ipchanger uh, ipchanger.sh once I press enter I need to press sudo password now the tool is being loaded over here so uh, I can change the uh, IP addresses in every single uh, uh, every uh, like I can define the parameter like in how much second I have to change the IP so if I make it as a um, like uh, time interval I can put 0 also to infinite IP changes so uh, this time I'm putting 0 and uh, here I can put let me maximize it and here I can put like number of a time IP changes like how much time so I will be uh, changing it per second so I am pressing 1 and now it's reloading and here uh, our new IP it is providing and it will be loading and it will uh, provide us few more IP so uh, first of all you also have to move to your browser any browser you are using then go to is this three dot and go to your settings first and then in settings you have to go to the network settings here in this particular setting option uh, if you uh, if you are using like uh, by default you will be having no proxy so you have to uh, set for the manual like by default this will be like your proxy will be no proxy but uh, we want to uh, route all of our traffic to the tor proxy so you have to set it to the manual proxies and then uh, you just need to check like SOC, uh, v for, uh, SOC uh, version 5 is being selected and in socks you, uh, you have to post uh, paste this ip like 127.0.1 and in port you need to uh, define the port as 90 uh, 9050 so once you uh, do all these steps like uh, manually uh, uh, do the proxy configuration this one and after that you have to tick this like uh, uh, proxy dns when using uh, socks file so you also have to take this check this out so i have just ticket out and once i press ok now uh, if i go with uh, <coughs> dns link test.com so uh, it is showing like uh, now, now my ip address is from germany so it is changed and it is uh, uh, changing my ip addresses multiple time if i just go with again with her dns link and if i refresh it again it is from germany i need to close the uh, like if it is not loading in uh, your system you need to close that uh, close your uh, browser and then again just start your browser so if i start and if i again check for the dns leak okay so now it's showing like my ip address is from sweden so it uh, takes a few more seconds to change it out so uh, that's how you basically change your ip address so first you have to uh, like install this particular tool uh, from uh, this github page like uh, here is it's a github page like uh, let me open the browser if you just go with uh, a tool name called g uh, gr gr uh, 33 n uh, 3 uh, 7 github so from here you have to first ins install this tool and all of my uh, traffics are going through the tor proxy that's why a little uh, slow internet but uh, no issues if you want uh, anonymity then um, uh, later, little slow internet is no, not a worry so from here you, you just have to clone this out uh, this link and then you have to paste in your terminal and then you will be able to like uh, installation is very smooth and very simple that's why i'm just um, uh, putting this tool out over here because it again as a beginner you can install this tool and you can start using it, it doesn't require uh, any uh, much uh, uh, technical skill so using this particular tool is uh, very uh, very smooth so just uh, come over here and uh, do and after that uh, just always try to check for dns leak like uh, right now it's in sweden if i uh, close my browser if i again open my browser for the dns leak now it's in uh, netherlands so every single time 
uh, you uh, connect to the internet it will be changing your ip addresses so if you want to confirm it uh, you just need to change so after that uh, you also need to uh, like if you want to 100 percent anonymity then uh, you can do one more additional thing like you can change your mac address too so if i go to my terminal uh, for i'm just closing this too i hope you all understand like how to change the ip addresses so if i just clear this out and i'm just uh, getting back from here okay so now if i want to change my mac address like uh, uh, we hope you all know like MAC address is a unique uh, identifier which is assigned for the devices on every network like uh, if you are using Wi-Fi uh, wi or uh, Ethernet whatever you are using uh, for every uh, thing uh, there is a MAC address assigned over the network so if you are uh, trying to be more anonymous over the internet like uh, uh, changing your IP is well but uh, for more uh, level of security you can change your MAC addresses too MAC addresses can't be changed manually but yes you can uh, check uh, change it over the network level so for that uh, we have a tool mac changer so uh, like uh, you can put apt install okay so now uh, it is showing like uh, it is already installed because uh, uh, by default uh, mac changer is being available over your system so you don't have to uh, change that so if i want to check my current mac address for that i can uh, do like i i i have config i have config and etho i can put over here uh, for my uh, mac right now like uh, what is my mac right now so if i go over here uh, you can see uh, like uh, uh, this is uh, my mac address right now so i we want to uh, basically change our mac address too so for that purposes i will be uh, like uh, i can just simply first let me open mac Changer help so we have a lot of options like uh, uh, we can uh, set up our mac addresses randomly like uh, it can it will be setting a random mac address so for that uh, let me use this particular option so for that i will be using mac changer uh, mac changer hyphen r for uh, the random utilization of a mac addresses and once i press uh, mac changer hyphen r and it will and once you press enter uh, now you will be getting a new new mac address like the previous mac address by this one and uh, this is the uh, new mac address so if i do app config it again now uh, here is the mac address uh, right now uh, which is uh, completely different from this previous one so if you want to set your mac addresses around randomly uh, you can uh, set, uh, set it using the r parameter uh, now, uh, now if you if i want to change to my previous one then i can uh, go uh, use hyphen p parameter to change my mac address to the previous one so instead of r i will be using hyphen p parameter and now my mac address is, is being changed to the permanent mac address the previous to that we are having some other options like if you want to set your own mac addresses then you can use hyphen m hyphen m option will allow you to uh, set your mac addresses like uh, um, on your own so 